Welcome to the part 3 of this video series. In this part, we will learn how to create a background design for our app and how to apply it. And we will also create a background design for the edit text element. And then we will learn how to create left rivals and how to apply them to edit text elements. And finally, we will create an icon for the left rival and will position it into the center of the triangle. Before we design the app, we need to remove the app bar by changing our view. Open the project pane, go to the resources folder and open the values folder. Now open the styles.xml file. Change it from dark to no action bar. Apply the changes and then the application. As you see, the app bar has been removed from our application. Now we change the background of our application into a nice looking gradient shape. Open the project pane, right click on the driver, new driver resource file, name the new driver, background design, click on OK. Now change the selector element into the shape element. Add a gradient. Angle 45. Now give the gradient a start and end color. We choose the random color here. You can also choose the color by clicking on the color icon shown on the left side. When you select the color options, the hex color values are also changed inside the text editor. Now choose a color for the end color. Move the sliders to choose your desired color combination. Now apply this triangle shape to the background attribute of our apps and linear layer. In my case, I have already chosen my colors. I will just copy and paste them here. Copy the start color. Paste it here. Now copy the end color and paste it here. Now apply the changes and run the emulator. Background color of our app has successfully been changed. Change the text color of our app's name to white. Now we create a background design for our testing link to fit. Right click on the driver, new, driver resource file, name it focus view design, and click on OK.
change the selector element to shape element. Shape rectangle. Now we give a background color to this sheet by using the solid attribute. Color Android white. Now give a border to this sheet. The stroke attribute is used for border. Width of border will be 4 dp color android follow green light change the border corners to radius corners radius 5 dp Now we apply this design to the edit text element. Background focus view design and the background of the edit text has been changed now. Now we create a left driver for this element. Right click on the driver, new driver resource file name the driver file decimal underscore left driver and click on the ok button notice that we are using the layer list element here because we want to display different items overlapping each other The first item will be used for the background of the driver with 60 dp, height 50 dp, and we give a shape to this item. Shape rectangle. Now we give it a background color, solid color, follow green light. So this driver radius, top left radius 5 dp, and bottom left radius 5 dp. Now we apply this driver to the edit text element by using its driver left attribute. Driver left. Decimal left driver. Excellent job. As you see, the left driver has been applied to this edit text element. Now we run the application. The left driver has added some beauty to our application. It is looking nice. Now we add a text icon to this left driver. We add another layer to this layer list. By using the item element, we we'll give it width of 32 dp, height 32 dp, and we choose the driver. For now, we have not created our driver, so first we have to create our driver that is the text icon. Right click on the driver, new image asset, choose the action bar and tab icons 
name the icon and choose the text option set the text choose the theme and click upon the next button and click the finish button our icon is now created now we have to reference it in our item driver attribute I see decimal. Our text icon is displayed. Now we align it into the center of our driver by using the gravity attribute center. Very nice. Now apply the changes and run the application. As you see, the driver along with the text icon is being displayed in our application. So far, so good. Thank you for watching this video. If it is helpful, please subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon for any future updates.